So our second e-bike has come, has come in. This one is Sarah's. It's a step-through model. And I found that some differences between the way that hers was shipped and mine was shipped. For instance, on mine I had to put the back rack on, as well as the rear fender and the front fenders. This one already came with the rear fender, the front fender, the headlight already attached. And the front wheel. And the front wheel. Uh, one of the big differences is the handlebar was not attached on this one. And they've got a protective ring of some sort here that there was a, a note that said you had to remove it. So I got to figure out what I'm doing with removing this protective ring. And then finish unwrapping. So let me go ahead and get it started. It did come folded and I unfolded it. Rest the packing ways. All right, there's my bike. Okay, so it was just a matter of uh, getting out an Allen wrench. Uh, and again, um, Jason did send tools but Paul just happened to have the right size. What is it you're having to tighten down? The uh, yoke that connects the handlebars to the stem. You reckon the battery is already charged up like yours was? Find out oh, we did find that, find that out later that um, we didn't have to plug his battery in for five hours. It was already charged. Yeah, really the only thing that was not connected, the only thing as far as assembly on this step through model that I had to worry about doing is attach the handlebars to the stem and it had a some sort of protective collar on it that I had to take off. I'm gonna to have to turn the seat around backwards unless she sits weird. No. <laughs> and it had some extra packing material on it that mine didn't have. Let me make sure that that's nice and tight. I hate for the handlebars to come off. Oh, that would be no bueno, as you would say. That little hole down there is where it plugs in? No. To charge? That's, the, that's what locks the battery in place. The charging hole is over here on this side. Oh, I didn't, I don't know why I didn't see it. Oh, okay. Plug in down there. So I've decided to help Paul finish putting together my bike and I'm gonna put the pedals on. Um, this one says R, so it goes on the right side. And it was just a matter of getting the right wrench to, to um, tighten it up with. So, there's my bike, mostly complete. And as Paul's does, it comes with a set of two keys. And the keys are not interchangeable on bikes. So he's um, gonna paint my keys white 
because my bike is mostly white and leave his black and he's using just regular white spray paint so there they are my two white keys so Sarah's bike finally came in it's about four weeks behind mine and so we're out trying them out together for the first time and they seem to be doing a pretty good job I put mine on pedal assist just so I could adjust the, the camera and we are we did hit an uphill stretch of the Lake Wales bike trail but as you can see, she's going uphill and not even pedaling, so she must be using the throttle. So I'm going to let her zoom past me. And then catch up. Hey y'all, we'd like to take this opportunity to thank you for subscribing to our channel. As of today's date, we have nearly 300 subscribers. So keep sharing our videos with your family and friends and tell everybody there's a new channel on the rise. Thanks for watching our video. Like and subscribe, give us a thumbs up, and leave us a comment. And as we always say, bye y'all.